Hello from the Philippines. Here are some outtakes, some bloopers that never make the final cut on my videos. So here's a background look at how I make my videos. Uh, hello! Um, we're a new video. <laughs> video, what am I saying? <laughs> Mistake. Oh, uh, hello! It's a new channel, an expat channel. And we're new to YouTube. And we value you, our audience, oh, so immensely. Without you, our audience, we're nothing. Well, let me cut to the chase. We're going to talk about things that men often do in the Philippines when they, uh, when they move there. Because we're a serious channel. We're not a tittle-tattle gossip channel. And we're not a riffy-raffy channel either. No, we're, 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 we're serious. And we value you, the audience. We love and respect you, the audience. Uh... So we, the, the, the kind of topics we're going to be, um, the kind of content we're going to be uploading, I mean, like you've got to be professional, haven't you? It's going to be things like masturbation. Yes, masturbation. Now, you understand, I never masturbate. I could never partake in anything like that, like you filthy animal. <laughs> Hi folks, it's, oh, my script writer hasn't given me the latest script. Hi folks, hi folks, hi folks. Doesn't fucking matter, the money comes rolling in either way. <laughs> oh. oh, hello. So this is the new channel. I'm an expat in the Philippines. I will never gossip. So today, because we value you, our audience, we're going to talk about how to masturbate while getting a suntan at the beach, discreetly, without being seen or filmed or doxxed or caught. That's C-A-U-G-H-T, not C-O-U-R-T. Now don't forget, you, our audience, are everything to us. Without you, I wouldn't be able to masturbate. Uh, without you, I don't masturbate. I, I never masturbate. Ooh. The priest wouldn't like it if I did. Now, we're a serious channel. About expat, mm, I want to lollipop Kojak who loves your baba. Um, other topics we're going to be um, covering would be how to stick a hundred dollar bill up your asshole without going ooh ah. Oh. It's very easy once you understand the technique. We're not going to be like those other channels. We're not going to be gossiping. We're not going to be putting other creators down. We're a serious channel and we respect you bastards. We respect you. We love you. You're our cash cow. You're our income. I would never masturbate over any of you. No, why should I? I uh, 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 dear God. <clears throat> Hi, folks. This is uh, that person here. Today we're going to talk about the cost of living in, in Thailand. Uh, not Thailand, in... Um, where am I from? The Philippines. Yes. Now, the cost of living is um, um, a bit high. No, I've not been smoking marijuana. It's a bit high. Um, I don't really know mu what, much else I can say about the cost of living, folks. It's a bit high at the moment. Um, I'm sure one day it might be a bit low, but uh, at present it's a bit high. Hi, folks. 
Can you safely find a Filipina and not get the pox? Well, the first thing you do is you bring a diaper with you. And when you're having sex with your first Filipina, you don't use a condom. You put the, the diaper around your dick. You will never get the pox. You will never get an STD if you follow what, what, what I'm kind of saying, I think. <clears throat> oh, dear. I hope I haven't alienated my audience. My script writer's on holiday, you see. <sighs> Got to come up with some content. I mean, some good content. Oh, I know. Hi, folks. It's the, the broad bean here. Today's topic is going to be about my sister Nancy and how she's not really my sister at all. She's been impersonating. She's a lying little bastard, if I can be so bored. <clears throat> but no, the real topic today is going to be, do you get horny? Do you get horny when you come to the Philippines and see us Filipinas? Do we make you horny? Do we make you more horny than the bitches back home? I sincerely think we do. Now, I've been a Filipina for 15 and a half years. It's been a hard slog. Before that, I was a Filipino. And now I'm a Filipina. Oh, ah, uh, oh. If you see, oh, what I mean, no. Oh. <clears throat> now, I would really like some of your money. I'm going to cut to the chase. I'm looking to raise $5 million. No, 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 I don't go on GoFundMe. I don't do that. Commoners do that. I want your fucking money and I fucking want it now. Now, those of you that have fucking properties, you fucking will sell those fucking properties and fucking give me the proceeds of that sale. Now, <laughs> I was only joking. Oh. oh, look at that. Now, I'm being serious here. As you know, my name's Grimble. I've just come back from Thailand. Mother was a fucking pain in the neck. Mother didn't leave her fucking hotel room. She was masturbating all day long on her vibrator. How embarrassing was that for Grimble? But guess what? I met a boy. Yes, <laughs> I met a boy in Thailand. <laughs> No, 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 no. Not that kind of boy. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You know when you're at sea and you see those big floats, I think they call them life boys. That boy, I, I met one of those, an inflatable uh, orange thing. It might be yellow. I don't know, I'm a bit colourblind at the moment. I packed it in my luggage, in my suitcase, I got stopped at customs and they said, are you, have you got any narcotics in there? I said, narcotics, what the fuck are they? They said, you know what we mean. I said, no, I play dominoes. I only know dominoes. They kicked me in my testicles for being rude. They took me into the back room. They said, you fucker, you fucker, you fucking come back from the fucking Thailand. What have you been up to in fucking Thailand, you fucking pervert? I said, I went there to play dominoes. They said, you f They said, you fucking lying bastard. Is your real name Gary Glitter? You fucking pervert. Or is it Pee Wee fucking Herman? I said, my name is Grimble. I only want to play dominoes. You fucking lying bastard. They kicked me again and again and again. All I wanted to do was play dominoes in Thailand. And I brought back a, a life boy, one of those big yellow orangey floats. You fucking bastard. 
They kept kicking me until I vomited. And then they stopped kicking me and they put a wet rag over me to make sure I, I didn't have any bruising anywhere. And they said, Mr. Grimble, I said, what? We're finished with you now. You can leave the room and go back into the lounge, into the airport lounge. I said, oh, you finished kicking me now, have you? Oh, we were never kicking you. We were just manhandling you. Oh, I thought you were kicking me. Oh, no, perish the thought. We don't do that here. We're civilised and it's against the law. So how was Thailand? I mustn't grumble. I mustn't grumble. I managed to get a few games of uh, dominoes in. Oh, really? Oh. <clears throat> Did you take your mother? Yes, I took that fucking boss. Uh, I, I took mother, yes, with me. And how? And how was she? Uh, she, uh, uh, she was okay. I won't have a bad word said about mum. Where are you, boss? Uh, mum. Oh, that's nice. Did you see any nice lady boys when you were there? I'm partial to a lady boy myself. No, don't really know what you're talking about. What do you mean, lady boy? I saw a life boy, one of those floats. You know, the one I've got in my suitcase, in my luggage, in my package, whatever you like to call it. No, I don't mean that. Would you like to go in the room for another fucking cricking, a uh, fucking kicking, you fucking perverted bastard? Oh. And you wonder why these don't make the final cut? They're not even funny. Hi, folks. Today we're going to talk about vaping and why you must never vape in the Philippines. Now, <clears throat> the reason you mustn't vape um, I don't know <sighs> I hope you've enjoyed the bloopers and the bloomers There's a reason these don't make the final cut Because they're shite do I have one last blooper? Um, let me think. Hello! So you've enjoyed our new channel, have you? Very serious, it is. It's a British expat channel. And we're very serious. We take things in our audience very seriously. No, there'll be no gossip on this channel. There'll be no backbiting or backstabbing on this channel because we respect you, the audience of YouTube. We have a reputation, a reputation to keep up. We respect you. Our audience, like no other channel does, you see, those other channels are shit. Those other bastard channels are shit. We don't like those channels, are we? We're respectful. We don't gossip or tittle-tattle about other fucking channels. We don't like other channels here. We'll never talk about other channels. They masturbate when they're talking to you, the other channels, under the table, they're secretly masturbating. We masticate here, we could never, we could never masturbate under the table because we respect you all, the viewers, the filthy pieces of shit like you all. Excuse me, I've got Tourette syndrome, you fucking bastards. You fucking little bastard audience. I don't mean it. That's all.